In this video, you will learn how to create a custom text field in Flutter. So let me show you a demo first. Open the app. You can see here three text field, name, email, and password, with different icon and different input type. So let's start coding. Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. So we just have three file, main, homepage, and custom text field. Inside homepage, we just have a simple app bar. Go to the custom text field file. Here we just have a custom text field class that extends stateless widget. Declare the text field controller above the build method. Declare the name. Declare the prefix icon. Declare the obscure text. Declare the text capitalization. And also declare the input type. Pass the controller to the constructor. Also pass the name. Pass the prefix icon. Initialize the obscure text to false. Initialize the text capitalization to none. And pass the input type. Inside the build method, return the container widget. Set a little margin from bottom. Inside child, return text field widget. Set the enable to true. Pass the controller. Pass the text capitalization. Set the max length to 32 and also you can make it dynamically. Set the max lines to 1. Pass the obscure text. Pass the input type to keyboard type. Set the text align to start. In style, pass the text style widget. Inside text style, pass the color to black. Pass the font size to 16. Create an input decoration and pass it to decoration property. In prefix icon, create an icon widget. Pass the prefix icon. Set the SDS to true. Pass the name to label text property. Set the counter text to empty. Set the label color to gray. In border, create an outline input border. In border side, create a border side and pass the color to green. Set the border radius to 10. Set the same border style to focus border property and also same border style to enable border property save the file and go to home page import the custom text field declare some controller for our text field in body create a single child scroll view widget set the padding to 20 inside child create a column widget Inside children, create a custom text field widget. Pass the name controller to the controller. Set the name to name. Set a person icon to prefix icon. Set the input type to name and set the text capitalization to words. Let's run it to see the changes. You can see here we just created a custom text field for name. Come back to code. Create another custom text field. Pass the email controller. Set the name to email. Pass the email icon to prefix icon. Set the input type to email address. Create another custom text field for password. Pass the password controller. Set the name to password. Set the lock outline icon to prefix icon. Set the input type to text and also set the obscure text to true. Save the file and run it. Now you can see the other custom text fields. Email and password. Inside name, I enter Ali. Inside email, I enter Ali at gmail.com. Inside password, I enter my password. In this video, you also learn how to create a reusable widget in Flutter. Thanks for watching. If you like our video, click on like button to reach more people. And if you have any suggestions or questions, let us know in the comment below.